What is up everybody? I'm John. I'm Isaac. And we are Cars and Cameras. Today is the day for our Mini Mayhem Spring 2019 meet at Busco Beach. We are running 32 minutes late, like usual, but we are five minutes out and uh, there are some people that camped out last night. Uh, apparently people have already been hitting the trails, they've already broken stuff and they're already fixing stuff. People brought generators, welders, sawzalls, like just cut off wheels, everything. Uh, we can make repairs out on the field, so that's awesome. Uh, from what I've heard, there are already 50 to 100 people there. So we will see when we get there, but it's very exciting and we're looking forward to seeing you guys. So we just checked in, there's a little booth and we are coming around here. We've got some go-karts over there and we should be in that area right there. We arrived at our meeting location to find that between 50 and 100 people were already there and ready to ride. We unloaded our projects and said hi to old friends, new attendees, and checked out some of the wild projects that people had brought. There was everything from stock Baja Warriors to three-wheelers to dirt bikes and more. There was even a homemade tank built by a guy named Venus who drove up from Tampa, Florida to attend Mini Mayhem. And get this, the turret actually shot fireworks. It was so cool. We had heard that the entire park was wet, but we had no idea what we were getting into. A lot of the bigger buggies and mini bikes with big tires did just fine, but everything else was struggling from the three inch layer of peanut butter mud that covered the entire park. met up at the drag strip and did a couple passes, but overall it was a soupy mess, so we kept moving in search of drier trails. <laughs> Meanwhile, our totally untested Yerf Dog GY6 camera vehicle broke down and needed to get a tow back to camp. Apparently it's a common problem with these CDI boxes. This guy right here, he's got a spare one. I'm over there! Stop you, brother! So, our camera guy hopped in with Dylan, who brought out a 1,000cc razor. This thing was bad to the bone. And that's the cool thing about these events. Anytime anyone has a problem or a breakdown, someone else is always there and happy to help them.
Our 420cc ATV performed pretty well out there, but we were fighting carburetor jetting issues and the fact that the air filter was getting covered in mud. I came across a couple that had totally sunk their go-kart in a huge mud hole. A few of us came together to help get them out. You guys did a great job here. Like, like, yeah. Thankfully, their air filter stayed dry so that when we pulled the cart out, they could drive it back to camp. When we made it back to camp, we got a better look at some of the other projects people had brought out, including a 79cc rat rod bicycle built by Leadfoot Jesse, who won the award for most unique vehicle at Mini Mayhem Fall 2018. Uh, 79cc a few other guys who drove down from Delaware built a rat rod wagon using one of the new style plastic wagon tubs. It started to rain, so we all gathered for a group photo and went out for a ride. Who's ready to go ride it? Let's go! In the scramble, I accidentally left our camera vehicle behind. They went with a small group to the back corner of the park where everybody got really stuck. Meanwhile, my trail master had broken down deep in the woods with a small group of riders. This event is a ton of fun, but it is a huge undertaking for Ike and I. Thankfully, my mom actually came out and helped to sell merchandise. That was a huge help. And here's a special thank you to everyone who bought merchandise at the event. And while you're at it, go ahead and press that like button on this video, guys. This was a ton of editing for us. Around 4 o'clock in the afternoon, yeah. I took the monster then, then truck out with a group of riders, and Ike and our buddy Charles began preparing Ike's famous beanies and weenies for dinner.
that. gotten their fill of Ike's world-class beanies and weenies, it was time for our award ceremony. The first award went to the most unique vehicle, the second award went to the most stuck rider, and the third award went to the person who traveled the farthest to attend the event. We're gonna start with most unique build. Uh, there are some definite honorable mentions out there. Yeah. The Mercedes-Benz go-kart, which is made like half out of uh, lawnmowers yeah. is pretty good. The golf cart was pretty yeah, cool with, with the, the big truck tire. tires on it. Yeah, yeah, there you are. That was good. That was very unique. <laughs> the uh, most unique has to go to the, the tank mortar. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Woo! It's safe to say that everyone's vehicles took a real beating out at Mini Mayhem Spring 2019. But for everyone that got stuck, there were always three people there to lend a hand getting them out. After this trip, I think everyone has a pretty good idea on what they need to work on for next time. Thank you to everyone who came out, it was a real blast for us, and I hope it was for you too. We'll be holding the next Mini Mayhem in Fall 2019. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you then. I'm trying to concentrate over here.